on the Rai Eyes, meet K-pop's new down-to-earth stars. When Rai Eyes goes out to dinner it's a 20-person affair. On this particular Sunday evening the pioneering South Korean mega-label SM Entertainment has reserved a private room at a hotspot in Los Angeles, Koreatown popular with music artists for its new boy band. The six members file in around a long table along with an SM-associated translator, who is occasionally assisted by two other team members, a publicist from RCA Records, an SM partner for Rai Eyes, a veteran manager from Seoul and eight additional crew members who sit in a nearby booth. The Korean group is in town for its Rai Ising Day Fan Con Tour tomorrow a fan concert where the group intersperses choreographed performances of its own K-pop hits with casual games informal on-stage chats among themselves and special covers of both K-pop classics and global boy band hits like One Direction's One Thing. It's Rai Ising's first time headlining a show in the United States but it's their group visit to LA. Before the May 20th concert the group flew here in August to attend the city's annual KCO and K-Pop Megafest and also filmed two music videos in town, The Jovial Memories, a pre-debut single that generated buzz for the group that month, and its official debut single Get a Guitar a Slick Bubblegum Earworm released in both Korean and English that's now Rai Eyes most streamed song globally with 219.6 million official on-demand streams since its September release according to Luminate. Not even a year has passed since our debut but so much has happened says Rai Ice's youngest member 20-year-old Anton as his bandmates nibble on non bread and citrus splashed hammocky crudo. Back then our group was like innocent you know. Now we've sort of adjusted to traveling and visiting other countries. In fact Rai Ice's members weren't totally green when the group made its official debut on September 4, 2023 through K-pop giant SM in a partnership with RCA. Shotaro and Sung Chan had previously debuted in NCT the ambitious boy band project that SM launched in 2016 becoming its two newest members in 2020 and contributing to Resonance PT1 NCT's highest charting Billboard 200 release. Two years later SM's board of directors moved to terminate the company's production contract with founder Lee Soo Man, from whom SM gets its name in 2022 in an effort to shift SM away from Lee's creative authority. In May 2023 Korean multimedia conglomerate Kakeo became the company's largest shareholder after a heated bidding war with K-pop titan HYBE, which initially bought Lee's stake in the company but then sold it to Kakeo during a tender offer, for access to SM's nearly 30 years of K-pop glory including an extensive catalog dedicated divisions for non-music opportunities like acting technology and the metaverse as well as dozens of active artists soon to include its newest edition Rai Eyes. Just days before Kakeo became majority shareholder SM CEO Jang Chiol Hayek revealed that as part of a company restructuring NCT originally pitched as a group with infinite members splintered into localized subunits worldwide would no longer infinitely expand and that Shotaro and Sung Chan would leave to debut in a new group joining previously announced SM rookies, the company's team of trainees, Yoon Seok and Seungan along with other Korean and American members. In July 2023 excitement mounted when K-pop media outlets reported that the son of acclaimed Korean singer-songwriter producer Yoon Sang later revealed to be Anton would also join the project. Finally on July 27, 2023 SM introduced Rai Eyes. The group, whose name is a portmanteau of Rise and Realize, launched its Instagram with 27 photos casual selfies and mirror pics without the flashy fashion perfect makeup or glossy finishes that often characterize K-pop photo shoots even on social media revealing the seven-member lineup of Shotaro Yunseok Sung Chan Wonbin Seung Gan So He and Anton. Six are at dinner tonight, in November SM placed Seung Gan on indefinite suspension though he is still listed as a Rai Eyes member on the label's website. Rai Eyes has sought to present itself as more down-to-earth a noticeable change from previous high-concept SM artist launches like the Supernatural-inspired boy band EXO, the girl group Spa, which sings about straddling the real and virtual worlds, and other larger-than-life K-pop idols the label has served up since the late 1990s. Rai Eyes describes its music as emotional pop a phrase it uses Anton says because we hope that people can relate to it emotionally. The members all do and I think that's what our fans want from us as well. But Rai Eyes differs from other K-pop outfits in ways that go beyond the aesthetic or concept. 
for one its social media approach is far more hands-on than that of its contemporaries who tend to have marketing approved captions, Rei's official sprinkles comments across fans' TikTok accounts. The members also filmed the Get A Guitar Challenge with influencers including Merrick Hanna, who has 32.5 million followers on TikTok, reacted to tasting Indonesian snacks with Jerome Pollan, 8.2 million followers on Instagram, and shot charming content with South Korea's most prominent openly gay celebrity the tastemaker Hong Seok Chun who predicted Wonbin as a face to watch in 2024. We have a concept called Real Time Odyssey Yun Siok explains. We post a lot of pictures of our daily life and intimate moments on social media. Anton clarifies, we don't really think of it as a concept we're just trying to show our authentic selves. Unlike many of its peers Rai Eyes also does not have a designated leader even if the Tokyo raised Shotaro at 23 the group's eldest and only Japanese member naturally steps up. At dinner he ensures everyone around him, including this reporter, has water and their drink of choice. He's the first to speak at the meal and divulges the most about his musical tastes, Sam Smith is a favorite. To his left is his fellow XNCT member Soulborn Sung Chan 22 whose beaming smile helped him become a host of the weekly K-pop performance TV program Inkageo while he was in NCT. One day he hopes Pharrell Williams will collaborate on a track for Rai Eyes. Shotaro likens Sung Chan to the color sky blue because he has a very clear heart, and is very innocent. Rai Eyes' four other members sit across from the duo. Born and raised in Seoul Yunseok 23 prefers calm ballads and the music of Ed Sheeran. While his outside demeanor matches his musical taste his bandmates reveal he has a more light-hearted side, as so he describes Yunseok is known for giving very random and fantastical nonsensical nicknames to everyone he meets. Anton calls them basically video game character names which makes everyone laugh. The 22-year-old Wonbin or Dark Ben as Yun Siok has dubbed him to the rest of Rai Eyes' amusement was born in Seoul but raised in South Korea's southern port city of Ulsan, he digs Justin Timberlake's 2020th experience era singles like Mirrors and Suit and Tie. Baby-faced powerhouse vocalist So He 20 grew up in Sai Hyung located in the country's most populous province Jaeongi, he is not only really bright Anton explains but his mindset is always really positive as well. Last is Anton 20 son of singer Yoon Sang and the actress Shim Hai Jin. While Anton has appeared on South Korean TV since childhood, Yoon Sang is based in South Korea, he was born in Boston and raised in New Jersey, growing up in the United States fostered his appetite for music discovery and exploration which ultimately became the foundation for his K-pop career. I don't really think I have a favorite artist per se he says soft-spoken but self-assured. I just like to explore as many genres as I can and try to listen to a lot of different music even if I don't understand the language. People who enjoy K-pop might not understand Korean. Anton's musical philosophy encapsulates the growing mindset of the young audience with whom Rai Eyes as well as SM and RCA hope to connect. As US listeners become increasingly interested in foreign language music Rai Eyes has earned 37.8 million official US on-demand streams contributing to 641.2 million globally according to Luminate. And it hopes to continue expanding its fan base, known as Rai Eyes pronounced Breeze, with the June 17th release of Rai Eyesing, the first mini-album. Its new single Boom Boom Bass incorporates the same hooky energy of Get A Guitar while adding shimmery disco vibes and an irresistible bass line. Sung Chan and Wonbin both say it's their favorite Rai Ai song yet. After five different K-pop releases topped the Billboard 200 last year driven by K-pop fans' love of physical product and labels delivering collectible album packages in multiple versions RCA Records' Ku John Fleckenstein says the label is absolutely focused on delivering physical versions for Rai Eyes in the United States but as just one way to elevate the group's presence. The vision behind our global partnership was to marry what both our companies do best across all areas to bring additional opportunities reach resources and growth to support Rai Eyes Fleckenstein adds. Our passion lies in exploring the intersection of music art culture and then connecting that to an audience. SM have been incredible partners who truly understand the market.
As the members of Rai Eyes dip into Basque cheesecakes for dessert they share their personal goals for the future both near and distant. They hope that Boom Boom Bass can crack multiple billboard charts and are looking forward to their first original Japanese language single Lucky Do in July calling it a perfect song for the summer. Shotaro dreams of someday performing at the Super Bowl and the Billboard Music Awards. Rai Eyes wants fans to understand that the fan contour is only the beginning and that the members plan to visit many countries. When Shotaro and Anton burst into tears during the band's two sold-out dates at Tokyo's Yoyaji National Gymnasium Arena in May it brought new meaning to the group's emotional pop and conveyed how much Rai Eyes wants an offline fan connection that is as strong as its online one. I really did not plan on crying whatsoever Anton reflects. That was our biggest concert to date and seeing the fans far away holding up our signs and stuff was just sort of overwhelming. At the concert the day after dinner the members manage not to break into tears but their performance is no less heartfelt. Amid heart-stopping choreography Anton pauses to address the audience. We'll work hard he says to become a Rai Eyes that Bri Eyes can be proud of.